What is going on everybody? Yes, that is Julio Jones on defense and no, I did not go into the settings and change his position to cornerback. In this video, I'm going to go ahead and show you guys how you can get a wide receiver on the defensive side of the ball, which means yes, in Mutt, you will be able to have two Deion Sanders items on the field at the same time thanks to his new out of position player card. Now if you guys enjoy this style of content, definitely leave a thumbs up, it really means a lot to me. And speaking of the out of position promo, leave a comment below and let me know what cards you guys think will be the biggest factor in competitive Madden going forward. Now on to the video. This tactic was actually used last year by Young Kiv at the Seattle Seahawks Club Series Championship where the tournament was held in the salary cap mode. Now this tactic is obviously very beneficial in salary cap mode in particular due to the fact that you're essentially getting a two-way player and saving a ton of cap because of that. Now, the way to get a wide receiver on the defensive side of the ball is by audibling out of the punt return formation. So you're going to come out in normal punt return. And as you can see, you can sub in anybody you want for your punt returner, wide receiver, halfback, cornerback, safety. In this case, obviously, for out of position Dion, you're going to be subbing in his wide receiver item. Now, the key is you can also sub in the cornerback Dion basically anywhere else on the field, ideally in one of those two gunner slots. So now you have wide receiver Dion at the return man and cornerback Dion at the gunner. And then whenever you audible out of the punt return formation, you're going to be able to audible into whatever type of playbook you're running. So if it's a 4-3 playbook, you will be able to audible into 4-3 stack. And if it is a 3-4 playbook, you'll be able to audible into 3-4 odd. Now it's very important to know exactly where all of your defenders are going to line up after you audible out of the punt return formation and into that 4-3 stack or 3-4 odd. So I would definitely suggest going into practice mode, trying it out a few times, noticing where everybody lines up, and then adjusting your personnel accordingly. The great thing that was just implemented into Madden was now you can customize your audibles in MUT. So now, not only can you audible into that 4-3 or 3-4 formation before, like last year whenever Young Kiv brought it out at the club series, you only had access to two man under, cover two, a man to man blitz, and cover three, but now you truly have access to any play out of that 4-3 stack formation. So in this case, you can have access to cover two, cover three, cover four, and then whatever other play, if you want a man-to-man -man blitz, if you want a cover one, a cover nine, whatever it may be, you'll have access to four different unique coverages that now you can choose to mold around your scheme. So in this case, you're going to go ahead and audible into one of those plays. And as you can see, the wide receiver who is set at the return man comes down and ends up playing that right cornerback position. So you're going to want to keep that in mind. That's the only place you're going to be able to get that wide receiver on the field is in that right cornerback position. So that's where your out of position Deion Sanders is going to be if that's who you want to use with this trick. And then say you want the other side to also be Deion, you could hypothetically be running a cover two style defense and have Deion Sanders in both flat zones. Now I just wanted to show you guys a few action shots of it in game. Now what you're going to want to do is as soon as you break the huddle, you're going to go ahead and audible to that 4-3 stack or 3-4 odd formation by going ahead pressing X and then as soon as you go to audible you're already going to be on the formation you just have to flip the analog stick to whichever coverage you want and if you do it quickly enough your opponent will never even be able to tell that you're coming out in punt return in the first place the only way they would know is if they pay very close attention to your personnel notice you have two Deion Sanders on the field and then they would have to know about this trick to know that this is what you're doing most people won't even know about this little trick to get those two Deion Sanders on the field so that's all you got to do as soon as you break the huddle go ahead and audible and you're gonna you're gonna look like you're in a standard 4-3 stack formation that's gonna be it for this video guys definitely subscribe if you'd like to see more content like this in the future and don't forget to leave that comment below about what card you guys think from the out of position promo will be the biggest factor in competitive Madden going forward as always guys thanks for watching